Hello, Mr. Niren here. Welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2, a game for the PlayStation 2 that I actually bought in the store back in 23, 2003. It was my second Dragon Ball game ever. It'll go straight to the Dragon World story mode. So I already uploaded a video at 2 hours 5 seconds, I believe, where I let the AI fight in P CPU vs CPU battles every character. Let's go to the Dragon World story mode. I want to play through this game. Again, I haven't played the story mode since 23 or 2003. So as you can see, it's like a board game. Story mode. Sucks, I, I already played the intro, I recall it now. If that's the case, we need to restart the game without loading, I believe. Let's restart Dragon World. Yes. Dragon Ball C. Long ago, seven Dragon Balls were forged, which when gathered together would summon the eternal dragon to grant a single wish. The quest for these magic orbs is a perilous one, one that Goku has forced all too often. For over time, the allure of the Dragon Balls has attracted a host of powerful villains. In order to protect the Earth and to prevent the Dragon Balls from falling into evil hands, Goku has thrown himself into battle. And always he is fueled by a single burning desire to be the best. So, this is the planet where Kakarot is supposed to be. Yeah, and those Dragon Ball things have to be on this planet as well. First, how about we exterminate the people on this planet with the Cybermen? Ha ha ha, this soil should grow some fine Cybermen. Raditz, you hunt for Kakarot. I'll search for the Dragon Balls and deliver them to Master Frieza. Fine, it's done. Stage 1, get the Dragon Balls before Nappa. Okay, so we need to hurry up before Nappa to get them. Please select an ally for a battle. If you are controlling Goku, of course we will have uh, Piccolo as the ally. Kid Trunks would be uh, unlore wise, he wasn't around in, during this time. And Krillin, Goten. Goten wasn't around either, and Gohan and Krillin are weak. Let's go for Piccolo, but of course this story mode is not entirely lore accurate. It will have some weird situations, I believe. Let's go for Piccolo as the ally. This is okay. Ah, so we can move both of them. We'll move Goku first. Let's... Uh, Moving towards the sword. Increased our strengths, I believe. And we can move uh, Piccolo. We'll move immediately to the armor. Increase his armor value. Plus 30. Now it's their turn to move. Alright, let's move Goku to the radar. Ah, we need to click on them first. Ah, we can only move there. We will move there then. Then we uh, can move Piccolo back. Good, they moved back like that. That's good for us. Let's take the radar with Goku the Dragon Ball Radar. It'll make it easier to find Dragon Balls. So, Dragon World. Alright, let's move Piccolo over there. He will face off against Raditz. He was first to face Raditz. Ah, Raditz moved towards Goku, I see. Then Goku will attack Raditz. He 
didn't have a fight. Dragon Ball C. Your aren't you? What have you guys come to this planet for? What are we here for? We came for the things you call Dragon Balls. After we kill everyone on this planet, that is. Lend us a hat, would you, Kakarot? What are you going to use the Dragon Balls for? That does not matter. Come with us and join Master Frieza. So this Frieza guy's your boss, huh? I would never join anyone like that. And what's more, my name is Goku. So this game had better story mode than I remembered. At least they speak to each other. It's not just pictures. Battle, defeat the enemy. Alright, next. We can do the King Kai feast times 20. We can go Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan 2, Super Saiyan 3. Kamamaha, Warp Kamamaha and Spirit Bomb. I believe it. that's because I loaded a saved game with everything, un everything unlocked. So you have all the attacks and such. So I believe in this game you can play the story mode and unlock every character and every skill and such in it. But uh, in the first time when you play it, you won't have all the skills and such. But then later if you replay the story mode when you have unlocked everything, then you can use all the attacks in it, unlike the first time. So we have access to every skill. You can go Super Saiyan 3 and such. Uh, so I believe when we played it first time, uh, without loading any save, I believe, then we wouldn't have trunks and goat and they might be unlockable. But we will play with this, I have no problem with that. We won't play it more than once anyway. Battle, defeat the enemy. And by the way, I think the graphics are really good using the emulator. PlayStation 2 is very good when you use a more modern graphics card. It's like the PS2 engine with a better graphics card in use, the, the one I use for the PC. My PC is using a NVIDIA Geffers 780 graphics card. Okay, let's defeat the enemy. Start the battle. I might suck in the game, at the game. I might not remember how to do most of the attacks and such, unfortunately. Face Reddit. Come on, it's easy to do. But, uh, this game didn't have any like clashes between uh, Kamehameha and that. Let's hope that the music isn't too low when we watch the video later. I know that it's lowered. Managed to grab him, and now we can throw him. So Raditz is his brother, his evil brother that he didn't know growing up. Yeah, we won the battle. We are playing on very easy because I didn't want to have too much trouble playing the game. I just want to play it through, like I did in the past. It was one of the games I played when I was younger, I believe I was... At the time of this release, in 23, I was 13 years old and about to fi- uh, Can you talk for real? And about to become 14 in a month, I believe. So I was turned into 14 back then. Okay, battle, defeat the enemy. Let's start the game. The battle. Or the fight. Fight Cyberman here. Take a uh, some time until I get good at the game again. Ah, we managed to do this attack, that's good. Now we need to roll this. Ah, we did it again. No, this is the Sanky Feast. We won. We didn't fail doing that uh, attack. 
possible to fail and miss the enemy there. But the skill of Xeen everyone can use effects. Nullify the effect of viral heart disease, which is a, a, a like a condition where you lose your health steadily while play, uh, fighting. Uh, so it's steadily decreasing. Uh, usage requirements are activated as soon as battle begins. Okay. Let's move Piccolo. This area uh, we can only move one point at a time. Now Raditz attacks us, so we have to fight him again. I don't remember how many times we need to defeat them until they are defeated. You're not getting away, Kakarot! You again! This time I won't hold back! Impossible! His battle power is rising so fast! Battle defeat the enemy. So if we use the rotational button, we can make uh, come out, send in, uh, spin around. We can even make him fly, I believe. Oh, we managed to uh, go Kaioki in. Times 20. I don't remember how I charged in this game. So it's possible to charge. I don't remember how. Charge the energy, I mean. Right, it's back. Maybe we can't defeat them 100%. Or no, maybe we can. We'll do that then. Try again to take him out. Sorry, but you are no match for me. Just stop the battle. Yeah, we can move him up by uh, moving both rotational buttons. Let's pause the game, refer to skills. Okay. I still do not know how to charge. Thank you, beast again. Good. This is a pretty simple fight there for the PlayStation 2. First one using self rated graphics in the Dragon Ball Runner. And uh, it's much better looking in HD than the first game that was a year uh, uh, older um, that I played previously, Dragon Ball Steel Taiwan, which was my first driver Dragon Ball game. This was, this was the second, and we are Super Saiyan Goku. So I click on both uh, R1 and R2 at once to, to evolve. But we also need energy, and we get energy by hitting enemies. We can also charge the en 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 energy, and I don't remember how. Skill name, Super Dragon Feast, only Goku can use, can attack opponent with enhanced force. Okay. Boom, get skill. I got the skill. Eh, we took out Raditz, it's possible to take them out. That's good to know. Piccolo down here. Gook there too. Something happens when they are next to each other. Let's use Piccolo and attack that Cyberman. Lousy small fry. Feed the enemy. 
Okay, so these attacks are synced with Nail, which is a uh, evolution. We can evolve it's like the Piccolo's version of the Kaioken times uh, 20. We have Fuse with Kami, an even better one, and uh, it won't change his look. Uh, we have the Destructive Wave, his version of the Kamehameha, and we have the Light Grenade, a better attack, and the Special Beacon Cannon, Hellsong Grenade, and Instant Kill Quick. Kill quick. Okay, it's very unlikely I will be able to do any of the better ones. Alright, the Cybermen. They are enemies in the story mode, but you couldn't play as them, I believe. They're uh, selectable in the dual mode. They are pretty good, I don't know why they didn't add them to the playable mode. And they had them fully playable in the story mode. The destructive wave. Defeated that one at least. Skill. Well, heart disease, okay. There, the figure in one. Try. Another one grew up there. But I believe the Saiyans, Nappa and Raditz, they plant seeds to make uh, the Cybermen grow up from nowhere. Like plants. Let's move to Dende here and then make him see what happens. He will probably be healed. But he, he wasn't. Uh, yeah, he, he gained a, a health point. Could attack that Cyberman now. I'll try to play through the first stage. You really are a strange one, huh? Beat the enemy. They have more Cybermen coming. Good, perfect. We didn't even get hurt. We won that battle. Defeated that Cyberman unit. Good guy. Get skill. Okay. It's their turn to move, I believe. We can move a Piccolo, we'll take care of another Cyberman. Can't get away from me. Feed the enemy. So the graphics are really beautiful for a PlayStation 2 game, I think. I was surprised how good they looked here. So I think it was the right decision to use cell shaded graphics. 3D graphics where they looked way older. This game looks much more recent than the first game when using HD and it's just one year between them <coughs> because this was the other, the next game after the other one Okay, Super Holy Water, everyone can use damage percentage is reduced, activated when damaged okay. Got another Cyberman <coughs> But now another grew up from the ground Nappa's moving and taking the Dragon Ball, that's not good. I got the Dragon Ball. Oh, no! But if we lose, we, we might lose. Fuck, we got game over. 
So I see we need to prevent them from getting all the dragon balls. We can't defeat every enemy. We need to defeat Nappa and rad it before they take the dragon balls. I see. So that's basically the story mode in this game. And they have a tournament and dueling. Let's uh, <clears throat> try the world tournament. I changed my mind. We won't play the story mode in this Please game. I suck at the class. game and I never liked the story mode. <clears throat> so back in 2003, I believe I played through the entire st st uh, board game story mode, which took a long time to do. And it was very annoying. I hate games like that when. <clears throat> And they can take all the dragon balls and we lose, despite defeating all the enemies. So it's, it's like, yeah, we can lose by losing the fights, but we can also lose if they manage to reach certain items before we do. So yeah, it's, it's an annoying game. And uh, yeah, I changed my mind. We won't play the story mode in this game. We will play the story mode in the third game instead. Which is like this game, but improved. And it's... Uh, completely different when it comes to the storm mode. It has a actual um, like uh, RPG style storm mode which is much better. Let's go for Noah's. So the world tournament mode. The world tournament is about to get underway. What kind of battles will we see unfold? <coughs> Three rounds total. Uh, four rounds in the adept and six rounds in the advanced. Let's go for the Noah's. Is the easier Which one. Will we, see? we can the in this one we can play as more than one player locally. That means that if if I take more than one player, then I can uh, control one. If I take two players, then I can control one character, and another another player can 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 control the other. <coughs> uh, so uh, and if we have more than one, then we can. If I have someone that I play with, then I can pick to choose some of them and a friend can play the others. And whenever they face each other, we can fight each other locally. So th this multiplayer has local multiplayer. Uh, this world tournament mode, I mean. While the first game only had single player, so this is better in that sense. We'll go for single player, of course. Okay. I'll use Android 18 here as well. Fuck, I didn't want to... I didn't want to take the normal one, I managed to click the wrong button there. We'll try this tournament mode. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming! We'll face Kid Boo, the strongest. Begin. Strongest enemy Majin in this game. Versus Android 18. This game only. Are you ready? This game only stretches until the end of the Boo Saga. There are no GT or Super here. Get lost, the eyesore. Both to center. I believe uh, Android 18 do not have any Super moves like many of the others, which is sad. She has some uh, special moves, of course. So you can win by kicking them out of the ring like this, or by depleting their health bars. The problem with the tournaments is that you risk being thrown out by the enemy. Now we'll face Dabra, Demon King. Okay? Okay! The second round starts now! Android 18 versus... Dabura! Please come forward! <coughs> Alright. Get lost, you eyesore. Well then, shall we go? Both the center! Begin! Yeah. 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 I believe it's easier to not uh, be thrown out in this game. The, the buttons are better, you have more attacks too, and they're easier to pull off than in the first game. You want to dash them out of the ring? Fuck you. 
So in order to move to his side I need to use the uh, right direction button. Fuck you! Fuck, we're, we're done. Alright, this, this didn't go too well. We lost in the second fight already. Not good. What a shame! Yeah, it could be. What a difficult. shame! We're looking forward to your next fight. All right, so that's the tournament mode. Please choose we your fighting class. Take advanced. Which fighters will we see? We the take eight mounting. characters. We take uh, custom version of Android 18. We can take. Yeah. See here. We we'll take Vegeta. Ah, fuck! I managed to move. Ah, I see. So, and Vegeta. How did I change the... I don't remember how I changed the looks. I don't want him to use that look. Let's see here, back. button ah, we can't change the look here I believe let's just take this Vegeta then could um, I don't want to play as ordinary Vito sucks that we can't use their alternative skins let's use Piccolo and uh, Piccolo was my first favorite character, then Vegeta became my favorite character. Okay. Can use uh, Great Saiyaman. Well, we could still use Vito. Goku, of course. Mr. Satan or Hercule. It's known as Mr. Satan in in the, in the European release and in Japan. You can also use uh, Kid Boo. Wow, the opponents okay. have been chosen. So this is the advanced tournament. Much bigger tournament. Gentlemen, thank you for coming. The world tournament will now begin. So we have eight playable characters. Goku versus Vegeta. Vegeta. Might be a player Are versus player. <laughs> I'm so excited! Come on, freak! Both to center! Begin! Yeah, we are controlling both of them. I only have one controller connected to the game. Yeah, uh, PS3 2 on the emulator. We will have to defeat Vegeta. So in this multiplayer tournament, we can play with friends. Up to eight players can play. That was pretty fun. I would have preferred Vegeta to win the fight, but I had no choice there. The winner, Goku. Piccolo versus Android 17. Android 17. Are you ready? Alright, now 
Android 17 is controlled by the AI. Shall we get started? Fight me like you mean it. So I didn't at first uh, I didn't remember if this game had local multiplayer. I thought I were wrong. I thought it had it. And I just was right. Try to defeat Android 17. He should be stronger than Android 17, or at least the same strengths. I believe it was the same strengths, but unlike Android 17, he gets tired. Another reason why I don't want to play this game in the story mode is because I am no longer good at it. I used to be like an expert at the game when I was younger, but I suck currently. I like that they, uh, they look uh, damaged like that when they lose and such and fall down to the, on the ground and such. Details that are lacking in games. So you lost the fight. Ah, you will need to kick out Videl. So these two are lovers in the story by the way. Son Goo and dressed himself as a hero. Okay, let's get started. Both to center! Begin! Sorry Videl, but you will have to throw you out of the ring. Justice Flash. If we move both rotation buttons, we do way better there. Maybe we only use one. Take this! Take this! Impotent! Take this! You can't teleport in this game. Alright. <coughs> How's that? Pretty cool, don't you think? The winner! Great Saiyaman! Krillin versus Android 18! Ah, I believe Krillin is AI ready? control. So he will be able to win this, I believe, unless he kicks me out of the ring. Watch it, man. I mean business. Get lost, you eyesore. Ah. Both to center! Begin! Ah, we can't control her because uh, it's set on player 2. Fuck. If they end up on that side, they are player 2 controlled, I see. We need a, 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 a different co controller. I have two controllers, but I only have one uh, s cable to connect to the computer. What a shame! <coughs> but I have a GameStop controller that I could use for the second controller. But I haven't configured it. Or configured it with the buttons. Mercule versus Napa! All right, we'll control her for Mr. Satan against Napa. Napa, <coughs> and he's on the right side, so we'll be able to control him this time. So this game actually requires you to learn the, the moves in order to do the best moves. I used to be able to do all of the cool super moves. I remember using fusions in this game. So this game, unlike the later games, have uh, uh, it does not let you start as Vegito or Gugito or something. Instead, you can uh, you can use fusions as certain characters. For example, Kid Trunks and Kid Goten can uh, use a fusion attack in battle. 
that will uh, turn them into Gotenks during battle, and then you can transform into Super Saiyan 3 with Gotenks. Oh, of course, uh, <coughs> uh, there are some uh, cool what if fusions in this game, so you can f uh, use fusion with more characters than the ones in the manga and anime. And as uh, such, you can end up with cool, unique what if fusions. I believe they used to be earring. Right, we are, are you ready? not able to control Boo, he will lose the battle. Labra is AI control, I believe. The fun is just beginning. Focus center! Begin! Alright, that's that. It's a good improvement that they've added local multiplayer. The tournament. Out of bounds. <coughs> yeah. All right. Oh, that's too bad. <coughs> okay. Okay. The second round starts now. Goku versus Android Goku seventeen. Versus <coughs> Android 17! And we will be able to Please fight this. Forward. You know you can't beat me! Hurry up, I got things to do! Both to center! Begin! <coughs> yeah! 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 So the reason I won't play the story mode is because it's boring and uh, I suck at the game, so it's no point. I might not even play the story mode in the third game because I am not very good at the game, but I have never played that game before in the story mode, so it could be fun to play it. Even though I, I would prefer the Tenkaichi games, they are better. I am better at using the buttons and skills in those games. They are like the tag team game, but for the PlayStation 2. Contested loses. <coughs> so they have better graphics, but uh, only one versus one. There are no tag team in it. <coughs> Great Saiyan versus Machin Boo. Okay, we'll control Great Saiyan. come forward. Against Super Boo here. The announcer said Majin Boo. Wrongly. <laughs> Both to center. Begin. Take this justice punch. All right, we did a justice punch attack. We threw Super Boo out of the ring. Good. <coughs> Champion of justice, Great Saiyan. The winner! Great Saiyaman! Ah, uh, he ended up the third to the right. He will lose now. now. Gohan versus Great Saiyaman! Gohan will win this that This is one. an interesting matchup! <coughs> Semi-finals. Alright, shall we get started? The Great Saiyaman appears! Both to center! So if we had two controllers, we would be able to just pick the other controller and play as this gun, uh, as, as uh, Great Saiyaman here too. <coughs> so one player can play as all eight characters, but you need both controllers then. And we are able to switch between them. <coughs> oh, that's too bad! And everyone is out, okay. Reach the semi finals. Okay, <coughs> let's check Babri's spaceship. Babri's spaceship has finally appeared, battle under various conditions. <coughs> one player or two players, we can play this against each other. Let's play, play one player then. Stage one. First, let's see how good you are. You keep defeating the opponents as long as your strength lasts. You can revive the ones you defeated. <coughs> so it's like a survival mode. <coughs> so who's going to fight? Now choose your opponent. Okay, let's 
uh, use Android 17, uh, 18 with her unique look here. This look is unique for this game, so we'll take it and custom. And now the opponent, which I think should be Vegeta. Then a Namekian armor. <coughs> On this stage, I think. The music is nice. <coughs> Get lost, the eyesore. Hail the Prince of Saints. Okay, entertain. <coughs> this game had some unique, cool skins. Every character had two different skins, and this uh, Android 18 had three. This skin is never seen uh, in another game, I believe. It's not from the game, uh, from the manga or anime, I mean. It's unique for this game. I love this music, that's why I picked the stage. Also, it's the Red Ribbon Tower from the Dragon Ball. The original series and uh, the androids or cyborgs they are created by Dr. Gero of the Red Ribbon Army, so it fits uh, the android. There is one other stage that also fits the androids, the hangar or whatever. I like that the stages can change like that. <laughs> So it's possible to do that without kicking such first. You can manage to grab the heat and throw him. Oh, he just continues to come like the Cyberman, I see. So whenever we defeat him, he will respawn and we can continue to fight until... I believe he has three more. If we defeat all of them, we will win. I think that's it. We are battling more than one Vegeta. We only have one and 18, making the battles more difficult. No, I was wrong. We have defeated him four times. We can defeat as many as, uh, I believe... Uh, uh, no, I, I think uh, <coughs> when we are uh, down in health, we will lose, <coughs> and they will just keep coming. It's a battle like survival mode where you can uh, just continue to fight until you lose, and see how far you get. And you get points depending on how far you get. <coughs> Alright, you defeated six of them. Yeah. Transform them into Super Saiyan Vegeta. Use the Gallic Gun! We are down! <coughs> Alright. Six wins, five wins, four wins. Uh, 150. So we got 231 killer. Just like points. So that's the stage 1, survival mode, then we have stage 2. <coughs> All you have to do is endure your opponent's attacks. Hold out as long as you can for uh, for my amusement. Oh, and it's no use trying to fight back. And the third stage, hehehe. <laughs> How many hits can you land before time runs out? Make this enjoyable for me. And then stage 4, understand. See how many key blasts you can volley within a limited period of time. I'm sure you can easily do 100 of them. <laughs> okay, but we're not interested in that. Alright, so this is Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2 for the PlayStation 2. And uh, it's the second game in the Budokai series and the second game in the Dragon Ball series that I ever owned. And the first game using the animated cell shaded graphics. And because the story mode is really boring. <coughs> I won't, don't want to play it, so we will not play this game anymore. This will be the final video unless I want to do some more dueling matches later. We'll see. Thank you for watching. Bye.